How does a level of effort activity in Primavera get its actuals? And how does it calculate percent complete? That's what I want to do and talk to you about in this video tutorial. It's Michael. So let's have a look here at this very simple project. Three activities with finish to start relationships that are all linked together with a level of effort activity down here at the bottom. So level of effort activities, if you're not aware, we link them usually with a start to start relationship to the first activity. So it has a start to start with excavate and it has a finish to finish relationship with the build activity. And when I rescheduled this for the first time, it automatically got its duration calculated. So, so now that we have that framework set, how does a level of effort get its actuals? In this video, I'm using duration percent complete type for my level of effort. So it's a straightforward duration percent complete. Up here at the top, the excavate activity is using a more common way to status in construction, engineering, oil and gas using physical percent complete. Let's see what happens when I go ahead and do a little bit of uh, applying some progress to this project. So on the excavate activity, I'll mark this activity as started. Let's say we've accomplished 20% of our work and there's four days remaining. So essentially one day has passed. I have simply moved my data date ahead one day and reschedule the project. Okay, so now we can see we're getting some actuals on the excavate activity. Let's go and have a look at the project management activity, our level of effort. So you can see here that it also picked up an actual start date because it's checked off here as started. And it also has an actual duration and remaining duration. So all of that happened from statusing the excavate activity. So a level of effort activity picks up its actuals also from its predecessors in all the activities that it summarizes. It now has a duration percent complete of 6.67%. So that's basically one day out of the 15 days. Okay, so that calculates to 6.67%. So in this simple example, it's pretty straightforward to calculate a percent complete using duration percent complete, as well as to status and automatically get your actual information to trickle down to your level of effort activity. I hope this was a helpful tutorial. Make sure you check out the next one.